Today I'm going to be reviewing these Walfo's heat resistant grilling gloves that I recently purchased on Amazon. These are designed for when you're out by the grill or whatever, if you've got a gas grill or a charcoal grill, or even if you're out by the fire, and to help uh, you know, with your hands and, you know, if you're picking up any pans or picking up anything that might be hot, what these are going to be designed for. So I'm going to open this up here and show you what exactly you are looking at. So these are all going to be rubber here on both sides of this. So when you put it on, you can see here, I can easily grab it. So these again are going to be a better than using like maybe a hot pad or something like that, just because you can get a lot of extra grip. Now it is going to be a little bit hard to bend the fingers on here just because of the material that this is going to be made out of. So you will get finger fatigue if you're using this a lot. And I mean that, like just bending it back and forth here uh, will wear out your hands and your fingers. It is kind of a stiff uh, rubberish type material that's going to be on these grilling gloves. They do easily fit. So I'm a bigger guy. I'm six foot one, 250 pounds, and I do have pretty large hands. And you can see that my hands easily fit right inside of there with no issues at all. So I can easily use these when I'm out grilling or whatever the case might be. Let me go and grab, grab the exact measurements on each of these gloves here. So they both should be about the same in regards to that, but I just want to give you the actual length and width of these gloves. So from the top to the bottom, you're going to have 13 inches, so plenty of room up your arm for protection. And then you're going to have seven inches, a little over seven inches, seven and a quarter. It's going to be the width of the thumb. The width of it itself is going to be about five and a quarter once it tapers down here at the bottom. So you could use just one of these or both of these. It's, in my opinion, going to be a lot better option than just using like maybe an oven mitt or something like that. Just because of this rubberish type material should handle like an outdoor outdoor situation, whether it's a grill, like it's a charcoal or gas or that sort of thing, or even if you know you have a fire pit or something along those lines, something like this should work considerably better just because you can kind of leave it outside and not have to worry about it. Whereas a kitchen oven mitt or something like that will break down over time. These are going to have that rubberish material as well. So overall, definitely pretty happy with these. Should be great as we head out into grilling season.